William Edwin Tyndall, Birch Trees and Snow. The artist William Edwin Tyndall was born in Scarborough in 1863 and went to Scarborough School of Art. At some time after that, he continued his art education in Paris, where he was taught by the Belgian artist Louis Timmermans. Interestingly, there is a painting in the collection of Heritage Doncaster by Timmermans showing a shipwreck at Whitby, and it may be that the picture ended up in Doncaster because of the friendship between the two artists. We don't know why Tyndall came to Doncaster, but, the, but by the time he arrived in the town he was a trained dentist, and after coming to Doncaster he opened a practice on Princess Street, which is at the top of Hallgate. It was in a room above his dental practice that the first meetings of the Doncaster Art Club took place, with Tyndall one of the main forces behind setting the club up. There are three paintings in the collection of Heritage Doncaster by William Tyndall, all of them showing wooded areas. Tyndall specialised in paintings of silver birch trees, so much so that during his lifetime he was known as Birch Tree Tyndall. Fold a piece of watercolour paper or card in half. Use masking tape to tape your card to a flat surface. Paint in your foreground and allow to dry. You could try birch trees like the painting or any other wintry scene. Apply your watercolour wash for your wintry sky. Wait for the surface to dry slightly. Then sprinkle the salt over the surface. Allow to fully dry with a clean brush, gently brush away the salt. <laughs> 